Good evening and welcome everyone. I'm Andrea Seagraves and on behalf of Harris County Department of Education and the Alliance for Young Artists and Writers, I'm thrilled to be hosting tonight's virtual Scholastic Art and Writing Awards Regional Ceremony. The night when we all come together to celebrate you, the next generation of young American artists and writers for your extraordinary creative vision. The Scholastic Art and Writing Awards are the nation's largest, longest running, and most prestigious scholarship and recognition program for teenage artists and writers. Since 1923, the awards have recognized teenagers from across the country. By receiving an Art and Writing Award, our students join a legacy of celebrated authors and artists. With over 300,000 entries across the nation and over 11,000 entries regionally, Tonight is indeed something to be very proud of. Good evening. I would like to welcome you to the 2022 Regional Scholastic Art and Writing Award Ceremony. Hope, creativity, and the future is what tonight is all about. Winners of the 2022 Gold and Silver Key Scholastic Art and Writing Awards, your families, friends, your teachers, and special guests are gathered here virtually to recognize you as a top young artist and writers in the entire state of Texas. We've been fortunate here at Harris County Department of Ed to be able to sponsor this event for the last 39 years. And it is truly our honor to recognize and celebrate your talents this evening. In my time as a teacher, a principal, and a school administrator, there is one lesson that I found to be so universal. And that lesson is, it is incredibly important to tell people how proud you are of them. So let me say it for the record. I am super proud of you. I am proud to be a witness in this moment in time as each of you is recognized for your creativity, and I'm so proud of not just your hard work, your dedication, and your talent, but for your bravery in sharing with me and with the world this extraordinary talent. So I will leave you with this. Your talent as an artist, as a writer, is extraordinary. And you have been able to hone your creative skills and your focus and make something last, something lasting that really spoke to people. Congratulations to each of you. You should be proud. This class of 2022 Scholastic Art and Writing Award winners, you did it. And please, 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 please keep up the great work. We thank you for sharing your talent and congratulations. Over the past couple of years, the world has shifted as we have weathered a traumatic global event. So it's no surprise that your work feels different, bolder, braver. Amidst this chaos, you stopped to listen to your inner creative voice and you did it gracefully, beautifully, and fearlessly. You have found your voice through language or through creating. It doesn't come easy for most people, and it takes courage and vulnerability to bring a part of your true self to the page, and that's exactly what the talented students being honored tonight have done. You've shown us who you are and what you believe in through your art and through your writing. You've given us a glimpse of the world through your eyes, and so many people were moved by your work. HCDE has proudly served as the regional sponsor for the Scholastic Art and Writing Awards since 1993. It's our honor as a county organization that exists to serve educators and students to present the awards program to you this evening. To learn more about HCDE, please enjoy a brief video sharing the impact our organization makes annually. Hey, Harris County, it's tax season. Ever wonder where your property tax money goes? Some goes to the county, some goes to the city, and some goes to special tax districts like the Harris County Department of Education. HCDE makes up one of the smallest amounts on your bill, but what exactly is it? HCDE serves all school districts in Harris County, providing a wide variety of educational services that support over 160,000 students, like schools for special needs students, preschools for low-income families, regional after-school programs, 
and so much more. In fact, HCDE provides over 50% of all special education therapy in the county and the largest adult education program in Texas. So how does HCDE accomplish all of this for an average of 73 cents per month? We are able to turn every dollar of property tax into $5 through service fees, grants, and our purchasing cooperative. So when you see your property tax this year, remember that the small amount for HCDE makes a big impact on students and communities all over Harris County, all for only an average of 73 cents a month. See the change your change makes at hcde-texas.org slash impact. A huge thanks to the Harris County Department of Education for the work done by your organization for our community. It's my personal honor to work for an organization that celebrates and honors students like the ones being celebrated this evening. You all have very powerful work this year. Your work is a collective type of magic, a class of creations that couldn't have been produced in any other time but now. That won't ever be replicated again, so thank you. Thank you for bringing your true current selves to the table against all odds. You are the artists, the writers, the creators, the innovators, and the inventors of your generation, and all of us are watching you, and we are hopeful, very, very hopeful. Congratulations. Each student selected to receive a 2022 Regional Gold or Silver Key Award in art or writing will be recognized this evening. First, we'd like to recognize our writers. Congratulations to our 2022 Gold and Silver Key Writing Award recipients. We hope you enjoyed experiencing some of the incredible works entered this year. When I look at your award-winning creations, I see all the ways that you have grappled with this ever-shifting, uncertain landscape. I see the pain and the anxiety, but I also see the resilience and the beauty and the hope. 
This year, perhaps more than ever, you have created works that speak not just to the global pandemic, but to the reckoning we faced as a country, to the calls for racial justice, for action on climate change, for political and economic stability, for truth. It's all in there, in your work, in the poems and the paintings that you submitted. In addition to those big things, there are many other things that young people are going through. There's self-discovery in your work and identity and hopes and dreams. It's clear many of you are using your art and your writing to explore your innermost feelings and to project your vision for the future. And for that, I can't say thank you enough. There's such incredible power in you sharing your very particular story with us. No matter what kind of art you're making, I believe in the dignity of your story. And I believe that creativity can heal people. Next up, we will share our 2022 Regional Gold and Silver Key Award recipients for art. Another big congratulations to all of our artists and writers. Your Scholastic Art and Writing Award is an achievement and many colleges will take your award into consideration when determining admissions and scholarships. So be sure to mention it on your college application or your resume. We now have a message from our National Scholastic team. Hi everyone. My name is Christopher Wisniewski, and I am the Executive Director of the Alliance for Young Artists and Writers, which is the nonprofit organization that presents the Scholastic Art and Writing Awards. This is the awards at 99th year, and across the country, nearly 150,000 teens submitted their art and writing to this year's awards. To everyone who's receiving a gold key, silver key, or honorable mention today, congratulations. You're being recognized for your originality, skill, and the emergence of your unique personal voice or vision. This accomplishment is yours, but I also want to acknowledge the teachers who have helped you and supported you along the way, as well as your parents, families, friends, mentors, guidance counselors, and everybody else who's encouraged you to find your voice and express your vision. The awards are only possible because of the work of our regional partners who administer local programs. They're the ones who process entries, arrange expert panels of judges, and pull together celebrations like the one you're experiencing today. The work may seem invisible, but it is essential. 
thank you all. I want to express my deepest appreciation to the hardworking staff of the Alliance for Young Artists and Writers. I'd also like to acknowledge the Alliance's many institutional and individual donors who helped to make our work possible, including Scholastic Inc., the M.R. Robinson Fund, New York Life Foundation, Command Companies, the Herb Block Foundation, the New York Times, and Blick Art Materials. For those of you who are still in high school or junior high, I hope that you'll consider entering your art and writing in next year's awards when the Scholastic Art and Writing Awards turn 100. And once more, for everybody who's receiving a gold key, silver key, or honorable mention in the 99th Scholastic Art and Writing Awards, I say congratulations. Next up, we have some special awards to announce. The first set of special awards are the Texas Art Supply Art and Writing Awards. Texas Art Supply generously donates $5,000 to our program each year. HCDE puts 100% of that money directly into the hands of our student artists and writers. Five artists are selected and five writers are selected. Each Texas Art Supply Award recipient will receive $500. Congratulations to the following students. Next up, we have the American Voice and Vision nominees. Five works of art and five writing pieces are selected as best of show from approximately 11,000 Harris County Department of Education regional entries. Each American Vision and American Voice nominee receives a cash award of $250 from HCDE. Congratulations to the following students. Our next set of awards are generously provided by HCDE Superintendent James Colbert and HCDE Board of Trustees. Good evening. I'm Danny Norris, President of the Harris County Department of Education Board of Trustees. I'm here to recognize several outstanding students who have been selected for the Harris County Department of Education Board of Trustees and Superintendent Awards. We are in awe each year of the incredible talent and can't wait to see what the future holds for each of you. Congratulations to the following students. Harris County Department of Education Superintendent Award for Art goes to Lily Forbes from SciFair High School in SciFair ISD. Harris County Department of Education Superintendent Award for Writing goes to Jane Mang from St. John's Private School. Harris County Department of Education's Board of Trustees and Center Award for Art goes to Sebastian Bonkanos from Pin Oak Middle School in Houston ISD. Harris County Department of Education's Board of Trustees Incentive Award for Writing goes to Janina Ajaduma from Jordan High School in Katy ISD. Harris County Department of Education's Board of Trustees Exemplary Award for Art goes to Ryan Lloyd from Galena Park High School in Galena Park ISD. Harris County Department of Education's Board of Trustees Exemplary Award for Writing goes to Hannah Gebrelow from Kerr High School in Aleph ISD.
Our last award of the evening is made possible through the partnership between Harris County Department of Education and a generous family who wishes to remain anonymous. This family asked to create this award many years ago in honor of a writing teacher who made a significant impact on the life of their child. That teacher was Susan O'Connor. So the 2022 Susan O'Connor Award for Teaching Excellence goes to... A huge shout out goes to the teachers and to the parents and guardians watching tonight. In a time where teachers had to reinvent how they teach and parents and families had to completely transform their daily lives, the fact that you all still manage to support your students through the creative process and give them the guidance and the tools and the encouragement to produce this level of work is absolutely remarkable. Those who enable others to be great are really our true heroes. So to the class of Scholastic Art and Writing award-winning teachers, you are the champions in so many ways. The world can be pretty bare and always needs people to decorate it with light and wonder. So thank you for taking on the task and congratulations. Thank you HCDE Board of Trustees and Superintendent Colbert for your generous support of the special awards and the overall program. Thank you Texas Art Supply for Monetary Art and Writing Awards. Thank you to the Glassell School of Art at the Museum of Fine Arts Houston for the summer scholarships. And of course, a huge thanks goes to the art and writing judges who are experts in their field and volunteer their time to support our young artists and writers. If you were a part of the adjudication process, please know that we recognize you and we thank you. Also, thank you to the numerous divisions within HCDE that contribute their time and effort and provide continual enthusiastic support of the program, including the Teaching and Learning Center staff, as well as HCDE's communications team. Student Award recipients, tonight is your launch pad to a bigger and better world, and all you have to do is create it. To all of our 2022 Regional Award recipients, you are extraordinary. Until next year, be safe, be well, and I'll leave you with one last look at the stunning work that brought us together tonight. Good night.